What up? We are back with another One Piece chapter reaction. It feels like it's been so long, so long since we had one uh, a One Piece chapter reaction. Actually, it's been since last year, a uh, couple weeks. But it feels like it feels it actually feels like a year. <laughs> it's been a long time, man. So uh, I want to hurry up and get into this. We're not gonna take too much time. We get right into it. One chapter, One Piece chapter 1037, Shuran Haki, Hake, what do we got here? We got, uh, oh yeah, that's right. Last time we left off, we were doing a, a, a German, a German cover story, right? So we got German 66, Cold-Blooded Voyage, Log Volume 2, Judge lets out a heavy sigh. Hmm. We got, uh, is that Ichi? I always forget the brother's names, but Reju and Judge. Sitting on top of the wall. All right, Flower Capital, here we go. I've been hearing a lot of hype about this chapter, so hopefully they didn't overhype it. The Fire Festival is also coming to a close. You've had way too much. I know you idiot, this is the only day of the year I can drink at all. After tonight, it's back to our country's bitter reality. Right. Right, Orochi? Quiet. You never know if one of his agents is around. Seems the festival is starting to wind down. They're getting the Sky Lanterns ready. Time to write your wishes for our ancestors to see. Will they really make them come true? Of course. So they're writing on the Sky Lanterns. Meanwhile, Onigashima continues his approach. Bash. They're going at it. My man Kaido taking a sip. <laughs> what is going on, yo? They really, like, it's supposed to be comedy. Why are you drinking? Luffy upset with him. Go, 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 go. Ah, because I'm having fun. You want a swig? The capital is celebrating the fire festival today. They're really trying to make, like, I don't know what this this relationship between Kaido and Luffy is. Because a lot of people complaining like, oh, it doesn't seem, it doesn't seem right. You know, because they don't want Kaido to become like a, a Luffy ally, which I understand that. He, he's, 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 he's an antagonist, he's a villain. He's done some villainous things. But uh, it makes sense if 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 the kanji or or however you you say uh, Kaido, you write Kaido in Japanese. If it actually translates to Joy Boy, then it would make sense why he's having fun. And if Luffy's the the reincarnation, we don't know if he's the reincarnation of Joy Boy. Like it makes it's it doesn't go against the narrative. So let me keep reading. And we and we were supposed to host a grand banquet here on Onigashima. So let me read that again. You want to swig? The capital is celebrating the fire festival today, and we were supposed to host a grand banquet here on Onigashima. Although you've pretty much ruined that. Foo foo foo. Foo ha 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 ho ho ho. Ah, yo, this dude is <laughs> Luffy. You're totally wasted. You better not use this as an excuse when you lose. <laughs> you dumbass. Whoa, ho, ho, ho. Getting drunk won't weaken me. And I've already acknowledged your strength. Whoa, he's real. Yo, he is cracking up. This man turned into the Joker. I can't remember the last time I was challenged to a serious one-on-one -on -one fight. Woo. I can't remember the last time I was challenged to a serious one-on-one -on -one fight. Here comes the agendas. Agenda confirmed, him and Shanks did not fight. If he can't remember, unless his memory is that bad, him and Shanks didn't have a fight. That agenda is ruined, that agenda is done. In the mud. Hey there. Shuran Haki. What, what is that, Shuran Haki? I don't know what that means. Can I get a translation? Hey there, somebody is singing. Who's singing? I guess that was, I guess that was uh, Kaido. Anyway, 
he, it looks like he dodged Luffy's punch. Look like he tried to hit him with an elephant gun or a Kong gun. I can't tell. Laughing drunk. Luffy looks worried. He's going. He's going for a club smash. Whoa, no, 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 no. Snap, snap, snap. Ooh, Ragnar, Ragnarok. Clobber this man. Come on, Luffy. Dome interior live floor. Whoa, the roof is cracking. First the castle's on fire and now the dome isn't stable. Yo! My man is in pain. I'm enjoying this. The castle and island are half destroyed. Talk about useless. Oh, he transformed back into a dragon. Seems like I can't even protect one lousy castle. Huh. That hurt, damn it! You bastard! I guess we could rebuild Sad Drunk Face. Okay, I was like, I'm. Because he was like happy and now it seems like he's going into a depressed phase. It'll take what, around five years? Whew. I've got to keep my guard up. <laughs> Is that Luffy saying that? I've got to keep my guard up. I did my best. <laughs> but maybe that's just not good enough. So now we get in a set. Like, this is nuts. Dragon, the Dragon Demolition Twister. Ugh. I'm guessing Kaido, yeah, Kaido hit Luffy. It's hard to tell what's going on in this panel. It looks like Luffy hit a rock. The way he's, I can't tell if he's he's flying back, but it looked like he hit a rock. Get away! Get away! Crying drunk face. Why, you damn brat? Now he's crying. He seems... This is what you get when you don't back off. Thunder! Bah! Pant, pant. Don't get ahead of yourself. Whoa! All right, so we getting some clean panels here. Makes me want to pull up the Procreate and start drawing. Luffy dodges the Thunder Bagua. Steps on the, the club. She, she, take that, you drunk. Cracks Kaido right in the chin. Kick the shit out of him in his chin. Yo, this fight is going to go hard in the anime. Bzz. It says, bzz. I guess that's the effects of the Conqueror's coating. Crack this man right in his chin. Oh, he caught him with his tail. But they headbutt. This man is crying while fighting. Headbutt Luffy. They had a Conqueror's Clash headbutt. Yo, these niggas is crazy, bro. Ah. It's my carbonated water. Luffy, Lu Luffy loses that clash, though. His hockey is getting stronger. You little... I was just starting to hit that good buzz. Why'd you have to sober me up, you brat? Angry drunk face. Looks like he shoots a, a borrow breath in his hybrid form. Come on, Luffy, you gotta go into your gears, man. Come on, what are you doing? <laughs> come on, come on, no! Jumps up, dodges the, the blast. Gun daddy! Kaido swings. Gun to the Gatlin. God damn. I wouldn't want to get hit by that shit. Meteor shower. 
Oh, I missed the word. It says rock. Okay. So Gumbo Gumbo no Rock Gatlin and Kaido does Gundari Meteor Shower. So he's blocking all of the Gatlins, all of the Rock Gatlins. Or they're attacking. I don't, I don't call it blocking, but it's like they're, they're both attacking each other. Yeah. So... Bruh, what is going on, man? Yo, this is one of the cleanest panels. I've, like, this is the cleanest panel I've seen in a minute. They went off. Oda went off when he drew this shit. Luffy gets hit. Kaido gets hit. They both fly back. Ha! Ah. He's swinging again. Kaido. Looks like Luffy stops the Thunderbagua with his hand. Goes in for the kick. Ooh! Kicks his nigga in the stomach. Uh, let's go, Luffy! The Holy Land Marijoa. Red line. It's as if the year's reverie was cursed. We should put what happened aside for now. Oh, we getting some, some reverie shit. Wano was the more pressing issue. There's no, what? There was no way of knowing that the battle would go this far. Supreme leaders of the world government. Nico Robin must have been apprehended by now. It's time to act. It wouldn't be out of place for someone to die unexpectedly. During a war that involves Kaido and Big Mom, this is our chance to erase that nuisance. What nuisance? Kaido? Big Mom? It wouldn't be out of place for someone to die unexpectedly. Alright, so they're, they're saying... No, wait! It seems like they're conspiring, right? It wouldn't be out of place for someone to die unexpectedly. Because it's a war, you expect people to die. So during a war that involves Kaido and Big Mom... They're going to use this as an advantage to kill the nuisance. Who's who? The seas around Wano. All units standing by. Ugh. What's the matter? Well, there's a giant shadow. What is it? No idea. An island? That's impossible. That fruit is nothing but a legend now, even for us. It hasn't awakened for centuries. So he's talking, the Supreme Leaders are talking to this guy on the world, one of the one of the ships going to Onigashima. That fruit is nothing but a legend now, even for us. It hasn't awakened for centuries. They're talking about Kaido's fruit. Because he's holding the island up in the sky and they're saying that's impossible for him to do that. So is this his awakening? His, his devil fruit has awakened. This is his awakening power. How else do you explain the world government giving a specific devil fruit a unique name? They were hiding the fruit's true nature. Wait, they were hi they were hiding the fruit's true name from the annals of history. What does this mean? What the hell is this? Shunisha? Shuni is Shunisha, right? The elephant, the elephant island. Why is it behind the world government ships? I'm lost right now. What is going on? That is Shunisha, right? Let me see. I, I forget the island's name. Mm -hmm. 
Zunisha. I'm saying Shunisha. Zunisha. <sighs> How? There's, there's, there's only one elephant that big, right? There's, there's only one elephant that big. But... It's following the world government. Now the 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 legend of Zunisha was it was cursed to walk forever in the sea, right? I don't I don't think they ever explained who cursed it, but it, that's what it was doing. But now it seems like. It's following an order from somebody from the world government. Was it Eam who did this? Could Zunisha be one of the ancient weapons? Why else would they have Zunisha? It's an, there's an island on his back, dog. Like, there's people on the island, right? <laughs> What the hell is going on? I'm really confused right now. I'm trying to put this together. This is nuts. There's an island on his back full of minks. The world government seems to be, it seems to have this in control. They're not worried about Zunisha, right? They they, they know it's behind them. So they're bringing Zunisha to Wano. Why would they do that? Why would they do that unless it was a weapon? That's the only thing I can think of. It has to be a weapon. An ancient weapon. I was thinking about, I, I saw a video uh, Some time ago, well, recently actually, we was talking about the ancient. Somebody said somebody. There was a comment I think about the ancient weapons being uh, a person, place, a thing, right? So this is this is just me spinning because this this might not be that. It might not be an ancient weapon. It might be something else. But if it is an ancient weapon, it would be you would have pluton, which would be the the thing, right? Uh, Poseidon is the person and Zunisha, if this is the ancient weapon, it would be the place. So you have a person, place, a thing. Somebody mentioned that and I thought, oh, that would be interesting if if the last ancient weapon was a place. Zunisha is, it's technically, it's a place. It's an island, right? I mean, it's a, you could call it a thing, but it's also a place. Yo, I don't know what the fuck. I'm, I'm just, I'm trying, I'm spitballing here. I don't know. I really don't know. I just know that this fight was crazy. This fight was dope. I fucks with it. Uh, wow. Those last couple of panels, though, with the world government. So they, they're trying to get rid of a nuisance. Who is this nuisance? Nico Robin? No, they wanted to apprehend Nico Robin, so that's not the nuisance. They wanted, they wanted, they want to apprehend, they want to apprehend her, but they want to erase somebody else for someone to die unexpectedly. Can't be Drake because Drake got washed. He would be a nuisance, right? But he's washed. It could be Drake. It could be who's who, because I remember them saying. Uh, World government or, or the CP, CP0 members wanted to kill who's who. That was, people forget about that, but they wanted to kill who's who. And he got washed by Jimbe, but I don't think they forgot about that. Plus, he's, he has a lot of information. He spilled a lot of information, right? He could be a nuisance. They, lock, they locked him up. He got out, became a pirate. I don't know. I'm just saying I like who's who's character. So like I'd like to see him have more relevance to the story, even though he got washed by Jimbei. But uh, it could be uh, Luffy. It could be they could be they're going after Luffy. I 
I don't know. Is somebody gonna die? What if it's law? Because there's theories that law is supposed to die and all this stuff, but law, nah, it's not law. I don't know, man. So after more deliberation, I've come to the conclusion that I may have been mistaken about uh, the island that the world government was looking at. Um, it's clear as day. Well, I don't know if it's clear as day, but um, since Zunisha is in the panel at the end, uh, I don't think that they were talking about Onigashima because initially, when you look at the panels, you see the world, you see the ships heading towards something in the shadows in the front, right? It looks cloudy. So initially, you know, we, we know that they're going to Wano. I'm thinking that they're looking at uh, Onigashima up in the sky. But then the next time we cut to the the panels of the uh, of the world government ships, you see the, the front of the ships with Zunisha behind them. So I'm thinking that they brought Zunisha with them and they were looking at Onigashima. But now I'm thinking that the whole time that they were talking about Zunisha because that whole sequence is talking about Zunisha and fruits and all that, which I'm still confused about. Uh, we, we won't know until Oda decides to clarify what he's, what he's, uh, what the information that he's bringing to us. But yeah, I was just confused by that. So I'm thinking like, okay, so they were looking in front and then the next panel we see the ships we see the we see the back of the ships first, and then the next time we see the panels of the ships, we're looking at the front of the ships with Zunisha in the back. So maybe they were sailing past Zunisha. Um, they were all making their way towards one. I'm not sure. I don't know what to make of it. But um, yeah, still I'm still confused about things. Uh, I read the uh, the 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 panels with the uh, with the Gorose again, the uh, the Elder Stars or whatever you want to call them. Um, just try to get more clarification of what they were talking about. So it seems they were they were discussing a devil fruit. So and the discussion leads into the panel of them showing Zunisha. So is this somehow this devil fruit is connected to Zunisha in some way? And there's something about awakenings. I don't know if they're if they're discussing the awakening of the fruit or if they're discussing. Zunisha herself being awakened or what or who's fruit like I'm 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 lost I don't even we don't even know why Zunisha is getting there um I, I'm thinking that it's Momo right because he has the voice of all things he can he can uh he can talk with Zunisha I believe or something like that I believe that's what it was I got to go back and read the old panels again oh man but Momo's fruit, they're not talking about Momo's fruit, right? Because Momo's fruit is an artificial fruit, which is based off of Kaido's fruit. So I would think maybe if it's if it's specific to his fruit, then maybe Kaido can do the same thing. I don't know. Maybe it's I don't know. I don't know whose fruit it could be. It could be Thomas' fruit. It could be Luffy's fruit that they're talking about. But that would just confuse things anymore because if they knew how legendary this fruit was, they would you you would have you would have thought that they would would have acted on Luffy's fruit earlier in the story, right? We're like a thousand and thirty, almost a thousand forty chapters in, and uh, we're just now finding out how important Luffy's fruit was. That's kind of weird to me, but you know, whatever. You just got to wait for the answers, I guess. So, yeah, I just wanted to get that out and clarify a few things. Dope chapter overall is done. I got things to do, though. I, I can't sit here and ponder all day. I'm sure we'll get uh, we'll get more information. There's a break next week. God damn. So I'll find something else to react to next week. Um, uh, I've been meaning to start uh, some other, uh, some other uh, anime or manga, manga read-throughs. So it's probably gonna be, um, I got Don to Don. I've been reading Don to Don, which I like. Um, and I've been reading Sakamoto Days. So I'll probably do one of those for next week, next Friday. Or, uh, or Jujutsu Kaisen. 
Let me see, because I haven't read Jujutsu Kaisen in a while. So I'll probably do that next week. And I'll start down to non for uh for another day, probably um probably like a Monday or Tuesday or something like that. I'll get my schedule straight. We'll get it straight. But um yeah, I, I, I thank anybody for stopping through. Dope ass chapter. Stay tuned. Peace.